Laura. Whether this is your first time with us or you're a regular attender, welcome. We're glad you're here and we'd love to connect with you. Please take a moment to fill out the connection card that's in your program with as much information as you feel comfortable sharing. On the back of this card is a prayer request form. If you have a prayer request, just let us know by dropping it in the offering basket. We also have a gift for you, a book entitled, Since Nobody's Perfect, How Good is Good Enough? Pick up your copy at the Welcome Center. Our annual Harvest Festival is coming up on Saturday, October 29th. It's a great night of fun and fellowship for the whole family. We hope you'll mark your calendars, invite your friends and neighbors, and plan to join us. We're also building a volunteer team. There are lots of ways to participate. If you're interested in partnering with us, you can sign up through the website or visit the Welcome Center. Also, parents, beginning the first weekend in November, we are launching electronic check-ins for children birth through preschool at the Kids Connect desk. Please stop by today to learn more and to make sure you're ready to check in with us this November. This Monday at 7 p.m., we have Authentic Manhood. Come and be a part of a community of men discovering God's perfect design for them. We meet in the sanctuary. Also, at 7, we have Divorce Care and Grief Share on the lower level. Our Kids Care Recovery Ministries for ages 5 through 12 meets on the lower level at 7 as well. Tuesday at 12.30, we have Prayer for America and the Elections. We meet in the sanctuary. Tuesday night at 6.30, we offer Clean for Men. Clean is a proven program for all men to help achieve or maintain sexual purity. We meet on the lower level. At 7, we offer Pathway. Pathway is our small group journey to freedom and wholeness in Christ. We meet in the sanctuary. Wednesday is Family Life Night. For adults, we offer In the Beginning, a Bible study exploring the book of Genesis. This class meets at Sacred Heart School just two minutes from Harvest Time. Harvest Time Student Ministries will be meeting in the sanctuary for all of our 7th through 12th grade students. For children, we have Royal Rangers and Missionettes on the lower level. We offer nursery care as well. Thursday, we have our men's prayer meeting at 10 a.m. on the lower level. Friday morning at 10.30 is prime time, our ministry for those 60 and older. We meet in the prayer room. At 7 p.m., we have GIFT, our ladies' mentoring ministry. We meet in room 106. Also, this Friday is Connection, our Portuguese language service. We meet at 8 p.m. in the sanctuary. Also, men, please mark your calendars for our annual men's retreat on Friday, November 18th and Saturday the 19th. Come and enjoy a weekend of worship, teaching, and fellowship together. Register today at the Welcome Center or online. Coming up, we have an exciting opportunity for you. As we continue to expand and grow in preparation for Phase 2, the worship team wants your help. We're looking for musicians, sound engineers, and computer-savvy people to help us with our live stream and media team. We'll be holding auditions in this sanctuary for musicians and we'll also have a brief meeting for those interested in the live stream or media team. You can sign up today at the Welcome Center or online at htchurch.com forward slash registrations. How many of you know what this is? We want to impact the world. This is my way of entering another country without physically going. I want these children to come to know the Lord Jesus Christ. I just see this fire burning in me that never goes away. You have the hands packing the gifts, putting them in the box, the feet carrying them to the other side of the world, and other hands distributing the gifts. You get an idea of the body of Christ. 100% of the churches that participate in Operation Christmas Child impact a church on the other side of the world. Close to 100 million shoebox gifts have helped tens of thousands of churches share God's love. For many of these children, they've never had anything new in their life. Maybe many of them have never had toys like this or a gift, but we gave this in Jesus' name. When we take the Operation Christmas Child to the community, they have accepted us. And it has been a wonderful tool to introduce us in the community. It enables the church to act like a body, locally, globally, to express the heart of love that the Father has toward people that He made. Not only Christian to Christian, and Christian to child, but church to church.
If you have any questions or would like more info on any of our courses or programs, please feel free to stop by our Welcome Center or visit our website at htchurch.com. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram for our church updates. That's all for this week's news. God bless and have a great day.